Sources are telling me Gino kicked Jasmine out last December. He allegedly caught her cheating with a guy who she met at Planet Fitness in Belleville, Michigan in November 2023. She has been living with the man since. I will leave the full name of the man out of this until it is all publicly confirmed. Gino is under NDA and cannot talk about this. I will let the pigs speak for themselves. Now we're going to move on to the next slide. The second slide pics are Jasmine's post and one of, <clears throat> sorry, which um, is one of the new guys she allegedly lives with, both sharing the same food. Plates and table is in this living room. Source confirmed is living room and his bedroom where Jasmine supposedly, supposedly lives now. Check out the date on those pics on your IG. There in June, so they're so on her IG there, June, she was allegedly kicked out by Gino in December. Okay, a source of the new boyfriend has confirmed he has been using the same bedroom comforter for years, and that is what she is laying on with the rose petals. Rose petals? Well, we move on to the third slide. The third slide itself, in particular, as you can see, the photos have evidence. Check out the third slide. Um, of the bread spread and couch and the timeline to when she started posting the couch and bedroom pics after December 2023. Again, Jasmine and Gina are both under NDA with TLC and cannot talk about any of it right now. The source said they both keep posting if they're as if they are still together um, because of TLC. And the question is, what are our thoughts? Do we believe Jasmine did this to Gina? I mean, listen, there's a lot of information that tells me that this could be 1000% true, but also at the same time, though, I wouldn't be surprised if this was a play by TLC to get the numbers up because sometimes controversy happens off air to help boost up the ratings for the show when the show may not necessarily be doing the numbers that it should be doing. There is also that side of things that we can never, never ignore. But like I said before, based on how we've seen Jasmine behave over the years, I wouldn't be surprised if this stuff is 1000% true. And also, regarding to the person's information itself in particular not being released right now in case it's not true because of course it needs to be confirmed first i will say this i've done some digging myself and i believe that i may have found the person but i'm also going to wait for some bit more confirmation before i also make that announcement as well but of course stay tuned subscribe and i will be here to let you know who this guy is once information is coming to confirm that yes gino has is no longer with g no sorry wait no to confirm that gino has kick Jasmine out and Jasmine is now with a new man which again would not be surprising to me but I will say this though Jasmine so far in this season has been talking a lot about her kids a lot about bringing her kids to the states and therefore right now you know she's not necessarily happy with Gina or at least the visa process I'll say this though if her kids are that much of a priority why the hell would you go and do a madness with somebody else because if you go and do a madness with somebody else the process of bringing your kids in, I'm not too sure how that can affect you, but at the same time, that wouldn't be a good idea because there's a possibility, I'd imagine, it's going to delay things to a certain degree. So really and truly, if these claims are true, Jasmine's a freaking idiot because really and truly, she's only jeopardizing the delay of her kids coming to the States even more. But this is why many people do believe that Jasmine isn't really that bothered about her kids, isn't really that bothered about seeing them, isn't really bothered about getting them to come to the USA anytime soon. Some people even believe that the storyline right now, based on her wanting the kids to come to the States, is nothing but just a storyline, a storyline that lacks facts, pretty much. Based on what we have seen of Jasmine throughout the years, we've hardly seen her mention her kids, and we've always seen her predominantly talk about herself, and always wanting things for herself, rather than for anybody else. Nonetheless, though, let me know your thoughts, your opinions, and we can talk about it. With that being said, shout out to 90 Day Update, and don't forget to like, oh, 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 oh I will say this, though. There isn't much weight on this one, but for some reason, Angela Dean decided to come into this and uh, she put someone asked John Yates and he'll tell you the scoop. So maybe he's got the truth. Who knows? But I would, I would imagine though, if he had the truth, he may have spooked it by now. But who knows? Nonetheless, though, don't forget to like, subscribe, and of course. Oh.